Well, art is everywhere this week here in South Florida as our Basel swings into high gear. CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo has been reporting all week on the annual event that brings tens of thousands of people to our area. Lisa joins us live now from Lincoln Road on South Beach. And I know you got a chance, Lisa, to sit down with a very, very famous, even iconic photographer. Totally iconic, Rick. He is David LaChapelle, one of the biggest and most popular and famous photographers in the world. Just take a look at the lines around right here. This is for his book signing that he's inside here at Tosh and Bookstores. People want a picture, a shot, and get to meet this iconic superstar who's inside. Yes, it's all about being picture perfect, and he's photographed the best of the best. He's been called the Fellini of fashion and celebrity photography, David LaChapelle, the man behind some of the most iconic pictures of our time. He has shot for every important fashion magazine, from Vogue to Vanity Fair and more. So this was the cover of Rolling Stone? Yes. He credits Andy Warhol as giving him his first break with Interview Magazine. So let's name drop. You have, you have shot unbelievable pictures of some of the biggest stars in the world. Angela Jolie, Madonna, Britney Spears did all her, her first covers. And you name us, I mean, Elizabeth Taylor to Michael Jackson to, I mean, I, I don't know. It goes on and on. Hillary Clinton. And I mean, how did you make that big switch to where every major star wanted to be shot by you? All I did was make great photos. That was my goal, was just to every photo just be something super special and that we hadn't seen yet. I wanted to, you know, look through the lens and if I'd seen it before, not, not press the button. David took 10 years off and is now back with two new photo books. One is titled Good News, the other Lost and Found, a complete career spanning anthology of his iconic photographic work from the late 80s to today. It's all about color. I wanted to walk away at the top of that game, you know, and, and then I didn't, you know, life had other, other plans and I got a call from the gallery and I said, oh, that, well, that was my first dream. So 10 years later, we have these books. Miley Cyrus is on the cover of Lost and Found. We blurred it as she's nude in a bodysuit. David says these two books will be his last. He's given everything he has to them. And Miley was great for the cover. She, you know, we've, we've seen just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to her talent. I mean, if you look at the, the backyard sessions, she did these, these songs, you can see on YouTube. She's incredible. I've been doing pictures and I, I want to not just make more stuff in the world. I want the pictures to mean something and I want to touch people. So when people see the work, that's when, when that's when it's finished for me, when they connect with it. Congratulations to you for so many years. And I know you're saying it's the last two, but I'm hoping you're like Cher and come back again. <laughs> 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 too good, too good. You can't say goodbye. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank so you good so to meet much. you. Yes. <laughs> Who knows? He could be like Sharon come back. The Toshin Bookstore is open here with David inside until the last person online. You can get these books here all day long tomorrow and for the time to come. From Lincoln Road, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS 4 News. I love these pictures. He's like one of those photographers where when you see a David LaChapelle, you know that yep. it's his work. Mm -hmm. Raw talent, David LaChapelle. Okay.